Hey everyone, this is uh, Mark Mickey from our cutting department, and we're gonna go through one of his Kaizens that he's uh, been working on over the last few months. So Mark, tell us a little bit about your problem. So my problem had to do with our uh, daily schedule and how we would usually get it. So we would open up the Internet Explorer page and we would pull up this Gerber cut fabric pole and wait for it to refresh, which takes a while, that's something else entirely. <laughs> and eventually, it pulls the data, there we go. There you go. And so it has all this information about uh, each job that we'll be cutting uh, for the week. So we are cutting uh, for July 9th at the moment. And this isn't in any particular order. Uh, I guess it was in, uh, it's not even in numerical order. I'm not really sure how the order is decided. Just random. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Uh, and it's not the order that we're actually supposed to be cutting in. So all of this is just like, it tells us what we're supposed yeah. to be cutting, but not when to cut it. And yeah. we're trying to do true pull, so that doesn't really help us too much. And you scroll all the way down to the bottom, and we have uh, all the different materials we're cutting for the day. Uh, as well as how much is being used, how much square footage uh, we'll be cutting from them, and their bin locations and material management. So what I did is I created a, an Excel program. That pulls all of this information, organizes it into the uh, into the schedule that we're doing. And again, it takes a while because it's pulling from the SQL database and I don't know, it's something someone else will have to look at. So when it opens up, uh, it'll be ask you what schedule for AMI you're cutting. Uh, so usually we're two days in advance. Um, right now we're cutting for the ninth. Uh, since we're kind of towards the end of the day, I'll just say no, say we're cutting the tent instead. So you get a little bit more information. It'll give you a thing about, okay, so you're cutting for the tenth day, yesterday was the ninth, in case we didn't finish everything yesterday. And then tomorrow is uh, the eleventh. So that we hit okay. It does a bunch of stuff in the background, sorts everything. And so you have uh, what we'll put up on our daily board over in our on their board in their section over there. And it'll say, okay, so assuming that the date ended today, and we're not gonna cut anything else, uh, AMI remaining, we have about 469 minutes and a quantity of 51 pieces left to cut. Um, that will obviously go down because there's still another two hours left in the day. Uh, so then we have uh, our tomorrow schedule. So about 1500 minutes, uh, quantity of 342. And this allows us to know like how, uh, what our load is gonna be for tomorrow and the day after. So if it's really low, uh, some, uh, Kwok or lead can send someone up to help another department. If it's really high, he can request someone to help out. Okay, so by give, knowing this information, pulling it from our database, it, you guys are able to make staffing decisions on how much you need, how many operators you need for your tables? Yes. Got it. Cool. Yeah. Okay. Not only that, but also has like some color coordination here. So if this ever, these numbers down here, they're ever highlighted yellow, that means we're over capacity. Mm. Um, if it, any of the quantity is red, that means it's not adding up correctly, which usually means uh, that there's a, uh, a material that doesn't follow the standard uh, 93 for leather, 95 for vinyl. Got it. And then we, so you have that, and then we have um, a couple more pages here that I uh, split everything up between leather and foam and vinyl, fabric, and firebox because we cut all those on different machines. Okay. So when we print, uh, like this print, it'll print out this page, these three pages, daily, leather, and vinyl. And so uh, when Vic or whoever is working on leather, they need to know what leather to get for the day. They just uh, look at so this So that page. becomes your pull list, yeah? Yes. And so then they, they know, okay, so we need to get, 
well, a very small amount, 3.6 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yards of uh, uh, square feet yeah. of yeah. AMD yeah. leather. Yeah. yeah. And huh. then also know for, uh, what's, again, what's going to be full tomorrow as well. Awesome. Very cool. Awesome. Thanks for sharing this guys in. It's really good.